everyone. Today I want to show you an incredible tool that will transform the way that you create presentations and this is through Pitch.com and the AI Presentation Maker. What I really like about Pitch is that it can create professional looking designs for any kind of presentation and it also has some great features that allow you to edit and not only that but you get to download your presentation for free at the end. So let's get started. So there are three main ways that you can start your presentation. The first way is that you can start with AI. You can enter your prompt and have Pitch create the presentation for you, or you can start with one of their templates or start from scratch with your own presentation design. So let's start off with the AI prompt. I'm going to enter a prompt here that says, create a deck on digital marketing trends and brand from start with AI. So what you'll see is that it takes about a minute to generate the entire presentation and it will choose a style for us and add the, the entire slide deck. Okay, and now you can see that it's generated the presentation for us. And obviously we um, have just given it a prompt and it's come up with these slides based on the prompt. Now we can start editing the presentation in order for us to add the detailed information that we want. You can also just change the color, say I don't like the screen color and I want it to be closer to say my brand colors. I can choose to change it to blue or I can choose any of the colors that they have over here. The other thing that you can do is start editing. As you can see, I'm now on my slide deck and I can start editing my slides. I can go to each slide and I can change the color of the slides if I wanted to. I can change the text and play around with the size and the headings. I can also change the pictures. So for example, if I don't like this picture, I can go to replace. And then under unsplash, I can select, for example, if I want a picture on Instagram and select that picture and it will automatically replace it for me. So quite a lot of features that you can use in order to edit your slides. You can add shapes, stickers, charts, all the different features that you're used to in presentations um, are there. Now, one of the most amazing things, as I mentioned with Pitch, that a lot of the different AI presentation maker tools don't allow you to do or you have to upgrade to do is that you can actually download this presentation into several formats so for example if I click on share once I'm done I can then click on export and then uh, select the PowerPoint um, exporting template and then export presentation and then you'll see that it will now start creating the presentation for me it's now been downloaded if I click on it I've got now the PowerPoint version of the presentation. You can also edit on the actual PowerPoint. So let's say I wanted to add something to my title. I can do that. I can also go in and change the pictures from the actual PowerPoint as well. Um, you can remove parts of the presentation that you do, don't want to have. So I can remove the uh, pitch branding if I wanted to and change literally everything on the presentation itself. So that's a feature that I find quite important as sometimes you don't just want the presentation online but you want to export it. Another option as we mentioned is to select a presentation from the template and as if you scroll down you can see that they've got a large number of different templates that you can use um, and you can find a design that you like or you can actually go to the side here and choose something that fits your needs so say you want to uh, create a presentation on a report you can select that and then it will give you presentation templates that are similar to a report style so let's say I select this kind of this template I'll click on that and I can see that the various different templates that it has within the presentation and if I like that I can actually decide to use the template and then it will take me to the actual page and I can start editing again using all the features that we mentioned previously over here and then when I'm done, again, you can see that I can have the option to export into a PDF or into PowerPoint and then extract the information and start using the presentation externally. So I hope this has provided you with a good overview of how to use pitch.com and to see the utility in using that tool. And please do let me know in the comments box what other tools you're using to make presentations using AI. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video.